Well, I, considering you watched the skip, if you watched all the games last night, yep. did those te- even the teams that lost, did they not play extremely hard? You look at Minnesota. They did. They went down and had a shot at the end to tie yep. it. Yep. Look at the Clippers. Mm-hmm. The Clippers was down 20 points at one time on the road and could say, you know what, guys? They get this thing up. And they got it all the way down to two, had a Russell Westbrook layup to tie the thing up. Yep. So if that's what happened on the road, yep. you know a team is going to fight for their very life at home. I agree. Look at Atlanta. Yep. They got closed out. Yep. They're on the road. Mm-hmm. Fought for their life. They got to win. Okay. I expect nothing less from the Grizzlies. They're going to not go down without a fight. This will be the toughest game the Lakers would have played all year long because a team is fighting for their life. They know there is no tomorrow, and they don't want to go home. They've done all this talking, and so now it's time to do all this walk, uh, uh, backing up of that mm-hmm. talking, or you're about to be walking. Okay. And so, yes, yeah, Skip, this is going to be a very, very tough game. How uh, uh, close to, like, uh, 80 for 90% can AD be with that hip? He's going to have to play good. Hey, game one, he was sensational. Yep. Game three, he was sensational. Yep. We need those type of efforts mm-hmm. in game five yep. in order to make sure there isn't a game six. Yep. And so that's what I'm expecting. I'm expecting LeBron probably going to need to be a little bit more aggressive. He only took two shots in the first quarter, and they were both threes. One of them was, was late in the shot clock in uh, game four. And so he's going to have... Cannot happen tonight. No, 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 You need no. to set the tone. Yeah, this is not a, this is not a game, Skip, where you feel it no, out. You don't it's feel it. okay, tonight. guys, I'm, I'm going to see how you guys get going. Yep. You know, hey, take the bull by the horns, flip him on his back, and let's get up out of there with a dub. Okay. So, odds makers. They're saying you are a four-point dog tonight right. in Memphis, and I'm a little surprised by that because when you look at the grand scheme of things... The Lakers are the Cowboys of the NBA. The (laughs) Lakers are a public team. The Lakers are, so to speak, America's team of basketball. The Lakers are a betting favorite with everybody. People love to jump on the Lakers betting bandwagon. So the odds makers don't need to to give you any reason to want to bet on the Lakers, and they are. They're saying, we'll give you four points in the Lakers, and I'm sure a lot of people say, give me four. I'll take it, and and I would say the same. Right. I would say I would take it because I believe the Lakers should and will win this game. Yet I look at what happened in the previous game, which was now two nights ago. Okay, yeah. The Memphis Grizzlies, in, in your building, shot 42 of 106. They managed to get up 106 shots, right. and they made barely, th- well, let's Call it thirty-nine point six percent of them. It's really bad. They're not a great shooting okay, team, though. From yeah. from three, they they shot nine of forty-two. That's twenty-one point four percent. Well, that'll get you beaten. Yeah. But what will really get you beaten are you missed sixty-four shots in this game. There are some games when teams don't get up sixty-four <laughs> shots and you <laughs> miss sixty-four. It was a reason that LeBron had. At his right. fingertips, 20 rebounds because they're there for the taking. They are available because there are so many missed shots by the visiting team. So I say, should you beware? Because I thought Desmond Bain had a pretty good game, but but he was three of 12 from three, and he was all they had. Mm-hmm. And our man Dylan Brooks, Dylan the villain, he shot one of seven from three. And our man, or my man Ja, he was one of six from three. Well, is it possible they go home and reverse these numbers and start making 9 of 12 and, and you know, 5 of 7? Skip, yeah, where, 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 the, where the Grizzlies beat you at is that they're tremendous in the paint. Ja, for a guard, lives in the paint. Jaron Jackson lives in the paint. I don't think they're a great shooting team. They're a big team. They're a different team without Adams. They're a different team without Brooks yep. because they pound you on the glass, Skip, and they get put back after put back after put back. Yep. Everybody lives in the lane. Uh, you, well, you know Stephen Adams not shooting outside the lane, and and, and Brooks is not shooting outside of uh, not Brooks, uh, the Brad, uh, yeah, the guy that got it uh, at Torres Achilles. Yeah. He's not he's not shooting out Brandon Clark. Brandon yeah, Clark. Yeah. He's not shooting outside the lane. No. no. So Jaron Jackson can make the three, but more times than not, Skip, he's trying to get to the but, he's but trying to get to the rim. They are the classic streaky three point yes. team. They can get hot. Okay. But they the question is, hot. Skip. In game two, in which Ja didn't play, we saw Jaron Jackson have thirty one. We saw uh, uh, Xavier. Uh, Tillman mm-hmm. have a career high at 22. But 
if you put Ja back into that mix, okay. that means somebody going to lose some shots because yep. Ja's going to get his shots. Yep. So if Ja, ja gave you 45, and then the rest of the guys have around 14. So what are you going to do, Skip? Are you going to concede? Ja, ja get yours. We're going to neutralize everybody else? Okay. Or do we let, you know, Jaron Jackson, do you feel Jaron Jackson yeah. can beat you? Okay. I thought my biggest takeaway from the other night was the unsung hero for your Lakers was Either. Dennis Schroeder. Oh, yeah, well, he was hounding. He was hounding. He was hounding. He was picking him up 94 feet. He made it tough on him. He made it tough on John ja Morant. This is the same Ja who in the previous game had scored 24 points in the fourth quarter. Right. The other night, game four, in the fourth quarter and overtime combined, Ja went one of eight. He went 0 of two from three. He scored three total points in the fourth quarter and overtime after scoring 24 the previous night. Darvin Ham found the missing ingredient. He found the magic solution to stopping Ja Morant. And I believe you're going to see Schroeder all over him again tonight. I think the thing is, Skip, is because Schroeder is a little smaller, it's easy for him to fight over picks he, because they put they, they, they run, they run, that's all they run. They keep, they, and plus the Lakers are not really good in pick and roll defense. So they don't know. They, yeah, oh, yeah. Because, but Skip, if you watch him, the way he can slither. He's shifty and wiry, yeah, and he, he's the same size. Right. They're, they're the same size. And they're both extremely athletic. Not Dennis, not, the, yeah, not yeah. the way Ja is in midair. Right. But, but I'm saying Schroeder is lightning quick. Yes, he so is. So he can mirror and match right. and, and he'll, bother. And, and, and one second, Skip, he'll slither. He'll go yeah. right over the screen. He will. And the next thing you know, Skip, he'll get to the uh, screen, and then he'll spin, and he'll be right like, that. damn, I thought you were. And he's right, he's right there. To take that away, and he did a great job of of, of and but but Skip, I think the thing is also AD is challenging everything that's in the ring, and so that's why Jaron Jackson gets a lot of rebounds okay. and putback because AD's coming. LeBron, LeBron is throwing. Rui is challenging people, and that's a really a good thing. And so look, look, you're right. They can get hot, but they're not a really a good shooting team. And so as long as you keep them off the glass and keep them out the paint, okay, Lakers I, have I an think excellent chance. Very quietly since the trade deadline, your Los Angeles Lakers have become the best defensive team in basketball. I really believe that. The pieces are there now. LeBron is recommitted yep. on the defensive end, especially as a shot blocker. Oh, we got Vando. He and Vando. He he's big time defense. Right. So is Schroeder. Yeah. All of a sudden, AD, he can command the oh, paint. Yeah. And even the other night when he had a bad offensive game, I thought he had another big time impactful oh, yeah. defensive game. Yes. Okay, why am I giving him a pass on offense? Because Jaron Jackson Jr. is a bad matchup for Anthony Davis because they're about the same size. Triple J jumps better than AD does. Right. AD's a little creaky right now. Right. He's a little deeper into his career. Right. And listen, AD's having a hard time on offense up around the rim right. because it, it, it's like... He missed, hands are he missed like four buddies the other okay. night. But though. he's seeing ghosts because that guy's he can oh, he haunt coming. you. He's yeah. coming. Because he blocked a couple of shots. Hell, I'm at the game watching him. Like, yeah. where'd he come from? Mm -hmm. I mean, he'll be, I mean, he's out of the paint on the back side. And the guy beats this guy and he's about uh, to lay it up. And, he lurks and he, he swoops. Does. And he lurked on LeBron on the game tire. And, and he almost got there, but he didn't quite LeBron had to go way high. Yeah, they call him ice drop. Because he had ice in his vein, really? and that was a teardrop because we call it an ice drop. Ice drop? Yeah. I've never heard of that. You, I, you ain't never seen one laid um, up that high either, did you? I, I think Austin Reeves is the one who's ice water in vein. No, Not no, LeBron, Austin don't do that. Reeves. Don't do that, Skip. No, no, Skip. He's, he's the one who invented you, it. You said that you wanted to see the man yep. with, with time running down put his head down. I did, and he did. He did that. He did that. I give him... High marks. I gave him an A minus yesterday. That's the best grade I've ever given LeBron for a game. Should have been an A. And, and if he weren't two for his last 19 from three, Skip. two for 19. It was what? Two for 19 Skip. in the last three games? Okay, I, I'm here again. I, I'm almost <laughs> going to reverse the, the bet that you proposed because you proposed going in the last game, he's going to make four threes. I yeah. should have taken it, but I told you, I like the Lakers to win this series. Okay, okay. I want to see the Lakers and the Suns in the conference. Oh, final. you want to run the bet back four okay. threes? No, but I'm I'm reversing the bet where I would bet you he'll make four threes. Oh, no, 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 Kyle, okay. I know what Go going to do. Okay. You know, close that. Okay. You know, this man, when, when, he, when, when he's up, uh, what, 3 1, he's 16 0? Is, is that the stat? Yeah, I, I, think, he's 16, stat. I okay. think he's 16 0. Okay. I believe this should be and will be a big LeBron night. I'm going triple-double on this night because he's going to smell blood, especially 
Dylan Brooks's yeah, play. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And this is the one where you say to yourself, high basketball IQ, I need this. Yeah. At 38 in year 20, I need this game tonight because it's going to give you a little respite. It's going to give you a little rest, right? It's going to give you a little bit of break. Because I, I think you're going to now play Golden State. We'll talk about Golden State Kings in just a minute. But because of the De'Aaron Fox injury, it looks like now to me it's going to be Golden State. Well, you need to rest up for Golden State because the, the stakes are going to be higher and the, the, oh, yeah. the intensity and the pressure, it's all going to ratchet up because they're defending they have champs. LeBron, hey, it's, 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 it's <laughs> Golden gonna, State Lakers. It's going to be great. I got yeah. you. He needs to win this game. Yeah, so I'm it. looking for triple-double. I'm looking for four threes tonight to break the this, this skid that he's on, two for his last 19. We do. You got it? We do. Two we do. for 19, that's 10%. 10%? you got to be better than that. So he's been hurting his team. I think he'll help his team tonight. AD will not have big offensive numbers because Triple J's got his number on well, the defense. Well, we just did a number on Triple J on uh, game three. We put 31 and 17 on it. I don't think you can. Well, I don't think we can. Yeah, because they're going to fight, as yeah. you said. Yeah. You, you see what happens. Well, he did, 20, he did 22-14 game one. Yeah. So, we, I mean, I split the difference, which I give, give me 25-15. Okay, from AD. AD. Okay, we don't need always disappointing tonight, right? No, okay. always dominant. I, I'm not trying to heap pressure on LeBron. I just think. He'll have his way with that team tonight. Pressure is what you feel when you don't know what the hell you're doing. Really? How many times has LeBron been in this situation? Uh. The man came, the only man to come down, come yeah. back from 3-1 down in the NBA Finals. Yeah. He's the only man right now who's two for his last 19 from three in playoff games. You remember when Boston, he was down, he was down 0-2 against mm. Boston. Yeah. And then went to the guard in a game seven. Really? Yeah, you remember that? I, I remember and that. And Brad Stevens says, I don't, I, 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 I can't explain it. I just remember that last series against those Celtics in his first go-round in Cleveland when games four, five, and six, he just crumbled, uh -oh. disappeared. And his owner accused him of quitting? Was, was that the game that KG said LeBron James uh, couldn't beat one on five? Huh, is, that, is that what he said? I that? just remember Dan Gilbert saying, man, quit. Yeah. So why a man quit? Why would huh. you go? Why, why would you? Brought fly, him back. Why would you go fly like a thief in the night? Yeah. Cut off all, yeah, the uh, uh, navigational system, <laughs> aeronautical, so nobody can't pick it up. Yeah, but they yeah. picked it up and fly down up for a lot of them to meet with a guy he that did. you said quit. Yep. And did everything that he wanted, gave him everything he wanted. Say, I need parking passes for this, 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 the horseman. I want them to have access just like you got it. He did all that for a man that quit. I was surprised LeBron relented to even go back, but he did. We forgive it. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. We're we'll forgive yeah. yeah, we got yeah. a great heart. Okay. But we did. We promised the people in Cleveland a championship. And thanks to Draymond, you got. Oh, there you go. Thanks to Draymond. Dray Draymond did not have no Cavaliers to land. <laughs> okay. And the man said, Cleveland, yeah. this is for you. Yeah. Well, actually, Kyrie hit the game winner. Don't do that. Oh, now you're a yeah. Kyrie fan again. Huh? No, I'm not. But he did do that. The you shot. Give him that. The shot heard around, though. The shot heard around the world. Well, the block shot. The overrated block shot. Don't do shot that, Skip. Don't do that. Bicycle built for two. <laughs> is, it not, is it not the most talked about block shot in NBA history? Unfortunately, it is. It is, unfortunately. <laughs> yeah. That was the GOAT. Yeah. Well, I'm, I'm curious to see what type of shape LeBron's in. Kudos to you for the bold bet, Skip, because LeBron did play a team-high 45 and a half minutes 45! Darvin Ham saying he was gassed. 45 and a half. Two million a year on his I don't care if you spent three... How much? How much you think as people start to age? How much they spend on anti-aging? I don't know. Go down to Rodeo Drive. I uh, go down to Beverly Hills and they on every clinic. Anti-aging, 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 anti-aging. How well I know. <laughs> as a female, I'm going to plead the fifth on this one and not answer and move y'all yeah. along. Thanks for watching, Undisputed fans. Subscribe here to get the very latest from Skip and Shannon. Plus, go watch a few segments from our other shows on FS1.